Good morning, everyone. Myself Mulli Dharade. In this video, we are going to discussing about how to create and delete the Git branches. Okay, let's see the demo. First one, before going to create the Git branch, first we will be understand what is Git branch. What is the branch? Branch is nothing but copy of code. Okay, simple example I can tell. Uh, we are uh, we have one application in this particular application we have uh, sign in and login sign up and login okay that is the one feature the data code is available in the particular branch okay then if you want to uh, implement if you want to add more features will be the, the developer will be create another branch okay then he, they will be work on the particular branch branch is nothing but simply we can say is branch is nothing but it is copy of that particular code Okay, simple example, we can see how we can create also. You will be understand more there. First one, how do you check whether the branch is created or not? Remember, when you are doing git init command, default master branch will be created. Now I'm checking here, git branch. When you use git branch, here we have a master branch. Default, the branch name is master. Okay, inside the master branch, earlier we worked, right? We have created git branch, uh, git type and project, and, uh, and then we have added multiple files, right? These are the files is available in master branch. Okay. When you install git in it, it will be created default branches master. Inside the branch, we have added multiple files and directories. Okay, got it right. Now I want to create the branch. Currently, it is master. I want to create a Jul July branch. Example, in July, we have a release. I want to work on uh, July branch. I mean, I want to work on some more features. So I need to create one branch and then I will be work there. Okay, example I'm creating git branch. July. If we give the July, what will happen? Git branch July, it will be create the July branch. Now enter. Now it is created. How, how do we verify? Using git branch command, you can verify git branch. Remember here it is uh, created a July branch, but where currently you are in? If you see here star, star means current branch. Star is nothing but current branch. Okay. Currently I mean master branch. What is right? Currently I mean master branch. Now if you go and check it, uh, July branch. How do you check out the particular branch? You can use git checkout branch. Git checkout the branch name. What is the branch name? July, right? If you give the July. Currently, I mean, if you observe here, you switch to branch that is July. Currently, I mean July branch. Now I'm verifying whether uh, where exactly currently git branch. Sorry. Git branch. If you observe here, currently I mean July. How do you identify? Here we seeing that star as star means. Current branch, current branch is July. If you observe currently in July branch, right? If I give the LL command in July branch also, same master branch data is available. The reason is, for example, you are in master branch, you are creating from master branch to the particular branch. What will happen? Another branch, what will happen? Whatever the data is available in current branch, same data is available in July branch also. Example, we have created July, right? In master, we have M2, M1, M2, M3. When, when I create Git branch July, Whatever is available in master, same data is uh, copied to, I mean, available in July also. Now, from here, I'm creating few more files. Example, touch touch command, okay? Touch, I'm giving M4. Now, I'm adding here, git commit, hyphen M, added M4, okay? Now, I'm creating in July branch, okay? I'm creating... July branch. Let's see. Currently, I'm checking here. Git status. Nothing is there. Everything clean. Currently, uh, the data is available in July branch. Now, I'm going to check out master branch. What will happen? Let's see. Git check out master. If I use git check out master, if you give the LL command, in master branch, we don't have M4. The reason is, when you create at the time, whatever files are directly is available in current branch, it will be, it will be copied to particular branch. Current example, we have created July. Whatever is available in master data, it is available in July. After you added, once you clear the branch, again you added M4, right? M4, it, it is applicable only July branch. It won't be available in master until unless you merge the data. Remember this one. Until unless you merge the data, the data won't be available in master. It will be only available in July. The reason is we have created the particular M, M4 file in only July brand. Got it right? Fine. I want to create the branch and check out the branch. Basically, what I am doing now, 
I'm creating the branch using git branch and branch name. Then I'm using git checkout branch, checkout command using checkout command. I'm uh, checkout the particular branch, but I don't want to run two times. I want to create the branch and check out the branch. How you can do? If you want to create and check out the branch, example, git checkout iPhone B. iPhone B is nothing but branch. I'm giving September. It means currently I'm in master branch, right? Master branch, we have M1, M2, M3, 4, M1, M2, M3. Those files will be available in September also. It will be create and check out. Create and check out. If you give enter, if you observe here, switch it to new branch. The reason is September branch is created and check out. When you use the git check out iPhone B, it will be create and check out the branch. Now, currently I'm in September branch. Let's see git branch. What is right? Currently star means currently I'm in September branch. And one more thing, remember here, I'm using git, git bash. That is the reason it is showing the branch name. But when you work on in uh, Linux server, same command might be sometimes won't be seen. Might be it won't be see this uh, branch name here in the linux okay whatever i'm working in git bash all the commands should, should be working linux also you can practice in linux or you can practice in git bash anything is fine okay next currently i'm in september branch now i want to delete the branch i want to delete the band how to delete the branch i want to delete the band if you want to delete the branch you have to give git branch iphone d iphone d is nothing but delete delete the branch the, we have to provide the branch name example i want to delete the september branch let's see how we can delete it branch iphone d the branch name scp scp means september now enter if you observe here we got error cannot delete branch the reason is currently i mean september branch and i am trying to delete the september branch only it won't be deleted. Example, I can give you. Example, we have open one file. Okay. In we have one, we have opened this file. Example. I have opened this file. Now I, I'm I want to delete this file. Example, I'm deleting this file. Usually it won't be deleted. Okay. No, example, I can I'm telling here. Uh, we have opened uh, any one of the file in uh, example, we have open word or uh, word file. Okay. You have open and you are trying to delete. It won't be deleted. The reason is it is already open. It will be throw the error like it is already open. Please close it and then you can delete. Same thing here also in Git. Okay. Currently you are in September branch and you are trying to delete same branch. It won't be delete. If you want to delete the particular branch, first you have to check out to another branch. You have to check out to another branch. Example, Git check out iPhone B. Sorry. Git checkout, I'm uh, checkout into July branch. Okay. Now, if you observe here, switch to branch July. Now I'm checking the Git branch. Currently, I'm in July branch. Now I can delete the September branch. Example, I'm deleting Git branch hyphen D sept. Now it is deleted. The reason is currently I'm not in September branch. Remember, you are in you are in current branch and you are trying to delete, you can't delete. First, you have to check out another branch, then you have to delete it. Okay, got it right. Any questions now? Next thing, currently I'm in July branch. Uh, here we have a M1, M2, M3, M4, and I'm creating one file, M5. Now I have created M5. Now I'm checking the Git status. Currently it is in working directory or staging area. Now I'm chocoting to, I'm not adding and commit here. I have created just file. I'm not adding and commit, and I'm chocoting the file. Git checkout master. Okay. Now, currently I'm in master branch. Again, I'm checking here git branch. If you observe here, currently in master branch. If you give the LL command, the M1 file, file also is there. The reason is you have created the file in any branch. You, if you are not add and commit, okay? If you are not add and commit, that file will be visible all the branches. Currently we have two branches, right? Two branches that M1 file will be available. The reason is, we haven't add and commit. Just I have created. If you create the file and you haven't add and commit, the file will be visible in all the branches. Remember this point. The files will be visible in all the branches. That is the reason. First, you have to add and commit. Now, what I'm going to do, I'm check out to July. Okay. Now switch it to branch July. Now I'm giving the LL command. I'm checking git status. Now it is 
uh, working directory. I'm adding and also I'm giving same command in single command, uh, single line, added the M5. Okay, now added. Now if uh, if you observe here, now I'm giving git status command. Git status command means it is clean. Now I'm going to check out uh, master branch. Then let's see. Currently I'm in master branch. I'm giving, sorry, BRA, sorry, get check out. We have to give the branch name. Branch name is master. Now I switch it to master. Now I'm checking LL command. Now if you observe here, M M5 file is not there. The reason is we have added and commit, right? That is the reason it is not visible in another branch. Still remember, if you create the file, if you haven't add and commit, the file or directory is available, uh, visible in all the branches. Whatever branches is available in the inside of git branch folder, everywhere it will be visible. So when you create, first you have to add commit, then it will be visible in only July, the particular branch. It won't be visible other branches. I hope understand that. What is the uses of uh, branch? How to create and check out without a single command, create and check out the branch, how to delete the branch. Okay, I hope understand that. If you have any question, feel free to comment. And remember, keep branch comments is very, very important in interview level also. Majority of the people will ask, I want to create the branch and check out the branch with single command. How can we do? Using git checkout hyphen B and you have to provide the branch name, then it will be check out the branch. Create and check out the branch. Okay, fine. Thanks for watching this video. We'll see you in the next video.